Now, media executives uh, from the southern part of Nigeria, representatives of media umbrella bodies and uh, media regulatory institutions, have signed a memorandum of understanding with the UN women towards escalating the media action to promote gender equity and women empowerment in the country. They signed the MOU at a roundtable with media executives on gender equality and women's empowerment in Nigeria here in Lagos. The signing of the MOU tagged compact of commitment was the key highlight of the roundtable with media executives, media regulatory bodies and civil society organizations. The signatories include the Nigerian Guild of Editors, the Guild of Corporate Online Publishers, the National Broadcasting Commission, the Broadcasting Organizations of Nigeria, the Nigeria Television Authority and about 30 other media outfits including print, electronic and online platforms. In our welcome address, the UN Women's Country Representatives to Nigeria and ECOWAS, Beatrice Ayong, emphasized the organization's dedication to bolstering women's resilience and professional development. Nigeria is a reservoir of uh, well-qualified, educated, uh, competent uh, women with expertise. Uh, they are di displaying it all over the world. Why shouldn't they be given opportunities, the chance to, de to, 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 to demonstrate it here? Look at the private sector. That has given 22% of uh, their, uh, their, their decision-making positions to women. Look at how it's thriving. By the time they get to 30%, 50%, I tell you, the private sector is going to perform more than it is doing now. Together, let us continue to champion women's leadership, dismantle the barriers that stand in their ways, and build a society where everyone, regardless of gender, has the opportunity to lead, thrive, and succeed. So giving women the opportunity to uh, occupy strategic positions in politics and economy will be a very um, desirable thing that the broadcast sector will want to project and want to give. And starting right now, I think we are in a very good hands. For example, all those stations where we have women as CEOs, they will be willing um, to project more so that they can have more women in the position, I mean, leadership and position. Sometimes you contest to make a statement. Who says women cannot join NNPP because of your presence in the media, because of your presence in the professions, because of your capability, because of your intellect? You weaponize it. How the media can support the effort how the media can help to accelerate these issues, how the media can help to bring visibility to the issues and challenges that women face and help to accelerate you know, the closure of the gaps that exist in terms of gender equality and women's empowerment in the interest of the development of our country.